Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see exercise 2.5 problems from our second chapter. So the first problem is use suitable identities to find the following products. Total 5 problems are there. So we have to use the suitable algebraic identity and calculate this value without doing actual multiplication. Okay, so you know the algebraic identities. Right. So, in that algebraic identities, it is in the form of x plus a into x plus b. It is in the form of that. So, what is the formula for x plus a into x plus b? This is first x square and next plus a b, a into b and Coming to the x term, a plus b into, so it is x square plus a plus b into x plus a. Here, in the in x place, x only there and in the a place, 5 and in the b place, 2. Right? So, x plus 5 into x plus 2 is equal to this is A and this is B. So write X square plus in the place of A 5. In the place of B 2. X is only X plus A into B. 5 into 2. So this is X square plus 5 plus 2 7X plus 5 into 2 10. So therefore x plus 5 into x plus 2 is equal to x square plus 7x plus 10. This is the final answer. Okay. And the second one here. x minus 5 into x minus 5. x minus 5 into x minus 5. So clearly it is in the form of a minus b into a minus b. That is, okay, before that, what is x minus 5 into x minus 5? It is x minus 5 whole square. When bases are equal, the powers will be added. So x minus 5 whole square. So it is in the form of x minus y whole square. Okay, one time give square to the x. And one time square to y. And here minus is there. So write minus in the power 2. So write to x, y. This is the formula. So here x minus 5 whole square in the place of y. 5 is there. So x square minus 2x into y plus y square. So that is x square. 2 fives are 10x plus 5 square 25. So x minus 5 whole square is equals to this. Third one 3x plus 2 into 3x minus 2. So all the algebraic identities should be in your brain. So just by reading this problem you should able to recognize it is in the form of x plus y into x minus y. So what is the formula for x plus y into x minus y? x square minus y square. So here in the place of x we have 3x. In the place of y we have 2. So x square means 3x whole square. y means 2 whole square. So, 3 square 9, x square minus 4. So, finally, 3x plus 2 into 3x minus 2 is equal to 9x square minus 4. Next, our fourth one. x square plus 1 by x square into x square minus 1 by x square. So, if you observe, this is also in the same identity form. So, write the 
identity x plus y into x minus y is equal to x square minus y square. Here in the place of x we have x square and in the place of y we have 1 by x square. Right. So, so in the place of x we have x square. So, x square and we have square here. So, whole square minus y. In the place of y we have 1 by x square and y square means whole square. Okay. So, a power m whole power m means a power m into m. Right. So, 2 into 2 x power 4 minus similarly 1 by x power 4. Our fifth one 1 plus x into 1 plus x. Okay. So, when bases are equal, the powers will be added. That is equal to 1 plus x whole square. Now, it is in the form of x plus y whole square. The formula x square plus 2xy plus y square. Similarly, 1 plus x whole square. x square means 1 square plus 2. In the place of x, we have 1. In the place of y, we have x. y square means x square. So, it is 1 plus 2x plus x square. Okay. So, therefore, 1 plus x whole square is equal to, if you write it in the decreasing order of the decree, x square plus 2x plus 1.